Craig Ritchie, and he's gonna give us one of the worst biking workouts that we've ever even heard of. Yeah, that's right. And then we're gonna go do a little go on sesh with our girl Amanda Barnhart, check into how she's up to. What are we gonna do with the watermelon? We gotta put elastic bands around that baby so she pops off. Shout out to our presenting sponsor, Blenders. 5% of all proceeds this month for them go to help them with COVID 19. Make sure you use your code Buttery Bros to get 20% off. But. Until then, roll the foot! Put this thing to the test. Old Craig Ritchie gave us the workout. And, uh, what are you thinking? Maybe we just gotta get a little more aerodynamic? I, I think I just need to put on something that's warm and aerodynamic. Let's go. Oh, 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 what? what just happened? Yeah. Look at snazzy, bro. I'm feeling fresh. You ready to ride this bike and get fast? <laughs> Don't judge me by my pelvic thrust. <laughs> We got Mars. <laughs> so, all right, we uh, just talked to Craig, run the footage. You look sharp. Yeah, you, man. You trim up. Sharp. Yeah, look you good, up? dude. Why didn't my dip? Jazz disappeared. Oh, yeah. what's up, Jazz? Oh, what's up there? Oh. You wanted the worst assault bike workout, right? Yeah, I wanted, I, I well, called Craig. Well, uh, we, we not just assault, got a, but. Uh, yeah, we got the Concept 2 bike I'm, here. I'm, 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 you want, uh, we'll start that again. You wanted the worst air bike. It's not even there, but yeah. sorry, we got dog brain. Yeah, you got a you got a puppy there. Yeah, welcome to the dog game. Oh, dude, look at that guy. What's his name? Carla, K A L A. It's one of the worst ones that I've ever done, and that like I wouldn't do again. So then I'll let you guys do it instead. Perfect. Uh, hey, look at it. Uh, oh, look at we're, we're on the whiteboard with Craig Ritchie. <laughs> three minutes off. We can do three minutes and then Mark can do three minutes. Five rounds. 1,000 meter bike into max air squat. That's it. <laughs> That's it? Oh. Yeah, so get competitive. Uh, <laughs> I can't remember my score. I think I got about 65 rounds. I think 300 is a good score. Uh, 300 wow. squats. Wow, okay, 300 okay. air squats. Damn. After just crushing your quads. How on the bike. Is your legs just feel so full? Like they literally feel like lead weights and it's just. Oh, the pain. <laughs> all right. All right. You do the first round, you're like, oh, okay. It's yeah, oh, I can't wait for your reaction after the first round. Thanks for the workout. Yeah, we'll, 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 we'll check that out. No worries. Crush it. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, guys. <laughs> so you're doing a 5K bike? I'm doing a 5K bike. And he said, he said shoot for 300 squats? Yeah. <laughs> what are you trying to do, bro? You got different. Uh... So th this, is, this, is, this is my goals. Let's talk about goals for, for uh, quarantine goals. Oh, all right. I got one goal. I'm trying to grow my hair to my nipples. That's my goal. <laughs> I'm trying to, I'm trying to grow my legs. Okay, okay. I got, yeah. I got two goals. Yeah, you got grow this one. Grow this one. You got a couple of chicken cutlets back yeah. there. Yeah, yeah. About to turn them into a full-on turkey breast. Let's go. Uh, okay, bird became a bird. <laughs> Ten seconds. Welcome to Thunderdome, Heaps. Yeah. yeah. Round one. Oh, look at that butt. Oh, hi, honey. Hi, honey. There you go. Got ourselves a nice light snow. April 2nd. Get ahead! Ah! Round one. I was trying to bait Mars and I was like, okay, I'm gonna go hard on the bike. Harder than I feel comfortable, but not as hard as I can. Really? There it is. Get him. Get him. Because I want Mars to think, oh, I'm gonna get him on this bike, but I gotta go a little harder. Dude, I think I can get you on the bike every time. It's the squats where you get me. Pull me in. I gotta hit the trigger figure. I'm going. I'm in. Here we oh, go. Oh, jeez. Ah. Ah. Huh. I got bogeys on Bahama Hami. I've been drinking green tea all day. You're gonna bring the demons out of me. He's moving. We got 56. Zero warm up. Ah. Big day! Yeah! Ah. Woo! What time do you get off the bike? Doesn't matter. 
It does. <laughs> I can get him on the bike every time. I had that a full matter. minute. I had a full minute every time. Yeah, I had a minute ten every time. Well, yeah. What's yeah, up? Yeah, yeah. What's up? I like how this dog is in the window here. Yeah, Rig, say hello. Hello. <sighs> when did you start to feel it? Round one. Round one, you got off the bike and you're like, eeh! Dude, I, I did my most amount of squats on the first one. I think I got like 47, so I didn't even get 50 each round. Do you have the official score sheet? Yeah, let's get the official score. <sighs> How'd you get? 44. <sighs> round one in the books. You got 56, I got 44. Hi, honey. <laughs> Craig Ritchie told us you got 65. Do you believe that? Yeah, Craig's super fit. Got big old calves. Big calves? Well, nah, you know. Come on. He, he could definitely handstand push up for a hot minute. Oh. Round two, if you got 50, I got 37. My legs are pumped. Uh, look at this. You big. can't read that handwriting. Oh. I got 50. That hurts. If I go further away. The paint you going. It's heating up. You can do it, I believe in you. You do it, buddy. Feel like I got grapes falling out of my ass. It's not where you want them. No. Nah. Oh shit. Ah. Heber's blowing me out of the water. My legs are Thanks, Craig. That sucks. There you go, dude. Oh yeah, that's the angle. Maybe oh, if I get in shape. Oh, that's not helping. Hey, honey. Round four, he's smoking me. He got 51, I got 33. I'm a... Uh... Shout out to Concept2, providing us with this sweet ass ride right yeah. here. We've always been a big fan of this. Shout out, but we did it back at Acid Bath Days, but now we're bringing it closer to home. There you go, bro. Oh, my legs. Oh, my legs. You better want it! Who's your childhood crush as a girl? Like a girl childhood crush. Uh, I really like Jennifer Love Hewitt. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah. yeah. She was a hottie. Oh, time. Ah. Oh. You beat me every round. Uh, what'd you get? 40. 40? What was your high? 44. Okay. My high was lower than your low. All right, so if you guys are gonna do this, shout out, tag us, at Buttery Bros. We wanna know what you guys' scores were. Can you guys hit the elusive 300 squats in the time allotted? I got 190. I feel like a inferior human. Oh. oh my God, my legs. It was one on the bike, right? No, I think it was the one on the air squats. Craig Ritchie got 65, 65, 66, 65, 68. Giving him a total of 329. I got 190 squats. <laughs> Talk about being a bitch. I can't believe how long you could hold that. Pump. How was my range? Am I wrong? It was good. I mean, you, it's you, questionable, but. Well, but no, your depth, your depth is good. It was just sometimes, sometimes you'd like come to here. Oh. Yeah. Thanks for telling me after. I said set them up. <laughs> All right, for that workout. Functional fitness strain on that workout. I was a 142 max heart rate, but a 4.3 strain. Not that high. I mean, my legs are. About ready to pop out of this, well, yeah. Okay, so my strain was a 9.0. My max heart rate was 173. How? But because you have like the resting, like lots of time resting, my average heart rate was only like 116. It hurt. How are your legs? My legs were so smoked, but you were able to hold a consistent up and down piston motion. I had to stop every like six squats to give a good little 
Oh, wee! Yeah. On to the butter gang. Butter gang, all right, I'm gonna check out Monday through Sunday average on recovery. Yeah, average of the week. Who's Shout out to my best? girl, Emma Scriff. Hey, Julie, Julie, put Emma right here. Yeah, Emma right over there. here, maybe. Or over there. So, Julie. Emma, you got a 98% recovery over the course of the 30th through the 5th here. So, how are we doing? How are you getting that? I mean, she's doing functional fitness, she's softballing, and she's got one fitness activity. Yeah, if you really click on her profile, like, you can see what she's getting into. There's one activity that's undefined. What is that activity? I mean, Emma, Emma you, you must be doing the softballs. I'm liking it. Yeah, how are you playing softball right now this week? Sleep performance, though, is down a little bit. Nah, 653, but. You're averaging pretty well there, Emma. Yeah, well done, Emma. I'm just curious, how are you playing softball? 10 feet? Yeah, what are you doing with softball? I yeah. don't understand. How's that happening? Shout out to Emma. Good work. Good work. If you want to join the Butter Gang, use the code PANCAKES and you get 20% off when you order your Whoop and then get into the Butter Gang with the code PANCAKES when it arrives. So where do you go now, Mars? Well, you know, jump on Amanda Barnhart, do a little go wad, talk to her, see how she's doing, catch up with her. Hurt she rolled her ankle at the games. Remember it? Okay, well, so I have some I have some specific questions for you, Amanda. One question about the 28, 2019 Reebok CrossFit Games. What happened to your ankle? <laughs> you saw what happened to my ankle. Okay. <laughs> I don't know how that happened. I just rolled it during the rock. I don't know if I stepped on something or what, but. Looked like you got sniped. <laughs> yeah, my brother told me it looked like I got bit by a rattlesnake. <laughs> yeah, snake in the grass, snake in the grass. How much did that like affect your weekend after that? There were some events where I didn't notice it. Like the clean, for example. I was fine. It didn't hurt my ankle. I was just a little bit lopsided, but like the 500 double unders and the sprint were really, really, really rough on it. The pistols were hard. I had to wear my lifters and like just go slow. There definitely was like certain events where I was like, oh crap. And then there was other times where it was like, I couldn't always work around it. Like my overhead squat felt weird, but I could still do it. It was definitely an unexpected challenge that came up pretty early in the weekend. Yeah, I can imagine. <laughs> You struggled on the sprint, but you made it through the sprint. How did you feel about the cuts at the games this summer? They were rough. I mean, I was like super emotional. One, because my friends were getting cut. And two, because I still didn't know if I was going to get cut. Like, hey, real quick, question, what stretch in, are you going into right now? Well, I'm just, I'm just navigating the app here. I'm just looking at some stuff. Are we switching? What's yeah, next? did you switch it? No. Like, you got it. We got no, it. Got man, it. I was just, I was, you know, freestyle, <laughs> bro. Freestyle. There's just so many people that are good, and it gives people opportunity to, like, mix up the leaderboard and you know win events and I mean the points when you get to top 10 it sucks like you get 8th place which in retrospect isn't that bad the cross state games but 8th place out of 10 is bad what is your athletic background like where'd you come from all of a sudden I'll say this year last year was your rookie year but I after seeing you train I was like oh top 10 yeah I remember you saying that um <laughs> I was I did gymnastics when I was young for like 10 years and I swam when I was young and then I, in high school, played four or three sports. I did volleyball, swimming, and track for four years. Um, and I was competitive in all of them. I've never had a point in my life where I wasn't competing in something. During college summers, I would like do triathlons for fun and just like have always been training my whole life. We were yeah. in the pool with the old man at the, the yeah. comp train camp. Yeah, I tried Remember to keep it? up for like a like a, a warm up lap. And they they literally literally you're a pretty good swimmer. He's a really good swimmer. <laughs> I remember that. I was literally just the yeah, shark. I was is. the I was the shark in the in the pool, just trying to get in your guys' way. Here to go. Oh, you were getting in our way. Yeah, <laughs> I'm, good. I'm a good getting away guy. You know. What is the best poolside food you could have? I feel like I'm thinking of like an ice cream sandwich because that's what I always have. Oh, when I was in the pool. okay. Uh -huh. Let me let you know that the classiest poolside food is Chinese, Chinese. food. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What are you up to now? Now that we're, you know, you're locked down and stuff, do you got gym equipment over there or are you just doing some uh, prison fitness? I actually have a pretty nice setup in the garage, so it hasn't been too bad. It's just weird. Like, it just hasn't been that fun training. I'm just trying to kind of embrace it and realize that it's not permanent. And as long as I'm working out and I'm working hard, I'm still, like, still making progress. Mentally, it's affected me just because, like, I mean, what I was would be going to Rogue in a month as previously, you know, which was in May. 
so like as soon as April hit, I would have started like ramping up my training again to get ready for Rogue. And now like that's not happening. It's going to be online, which I don't know what that even means. Are but you, it's going to, and it's a month later now. Are you going to do the online competition? For Rogue? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, I just still don't know. Like it's still different though. You know what I mean? Like it's not the same. It doesn't like light the fire like it does knowing you're going to the competition. Next question. What are you watching on Netflix? Like what, what's, what's, have you watched what, Tiger King? Have you watched Tiger King? Are you up to date? You know about Carol Baskin? <laughs> I started it. I could not watch the rest of it. <laughs> <laughs> what is like a goal you're trying to accomplish while isolation is happening? Number one, just like enjoy the downtime with my husband. Like he normally works like 90 hours a week and he's off right now. So we're getting to spend a lot of quality time together. And I think that it's, you know, a blessing in disguise that everyone's home with their families right now. So Awesome. Okay. You got any other questions? I think we're good. Okay. All right. Enjoy Thanks. your day of rest. Thank you. Thank good you. seeing you guys. Good, good to see you too. Amanda. Bye, Amanda. Take care. Bye. Bye. Okay, so today we're being scientists. Yeah, man, safety third. We're playing, we're playing uh, hot potato, watermelon. Uh, you go, I go. Three rubber bands around it. I go three, he goes three until it explodes. You may have seen this uh, on the internet. On the tubes. And now it is on the internet. Science. Okay, so we're at like 20 minutes in. We're going in a hot minute, bro. Woo, how back you feeling? Tired. Yeah, my back is a little tired. My quads still feel it from that workout. How we doing? I mean. You think we're at like five more? I have no idea, man. It's not like I'm wondering if it's ever gonna happen. I don't want. Hi, honey. I don't need. I have three bags of rubber bands. Not enough. Man. Uh, huh. Hats off. To the, to the dude. Yeah, we, he's we'll, crushing us. we'll be back. We'll go get more. Yeah, we'll circle back in a minute. I don't care. I care and I won't give. All I need is only so Come on! Oh, oh, it? No, it can't be it. It's happening. It's coming. Go, go. Take that, Beatrix! That was tremendous. I guess let's go to the outro. Oh, oh, that's it. Oh, squats, they're tough. Oh, man, my legs are blown. That's the end of our show today. Who we got to thank? Well, we got to thank Blenders. You know, stay blended over here. Use code Butter Bros. Save something. Also, Whoop and Go Wad. Also, join us in United in Movement. We want to make sure we raise funds for gyms. They're all small businesses that need our help right now. Ah, but. Who should we look at next? What's our outro right now? I mean, here's some clips of some people shaking some butter. Shake it. Just for the thrill of it. Nothing kind of it with you. Just for the thrill of it. Better work. Butter challenge. Just buttery. Let's roll the footage. You just for the thrill of it.